be honest with you, where I want those guys, I know they're going to make mistakes, and, and that's okay from a standpoint of day one. But I'm really looking for style of play, the effort, the energy, the tenacity we're looking for. I'm looking for ball hawks. And I guess if you make a mistake, I want you to make it going 100 miles an hour. I don't, I don't want guys to hesitate. I don't want guys to sit there and throw their hands in the air and say, Coach, I don't get it. I want you to figure it out on the run, man. Just go, just run. When in doubt, run fast. And we'll figure it out from there. I know you're big on speed. Can you sense a difference in the, in the, in the level of speed of your overall group? I, I tell you, I, I can sense that they've worked hard in the offseason. I think with Rock's done with those guys and them buying into the offseason conditioning program and the weight program, I see an explosive group. Um, I just got to see it consistently in every in every practice we have. The new guys have they been have they been lost at all these first two days, or have they been pretty? No, we, we're taking it. We're taking a slow approach to things. I think they're finding their way. The hardest thing for a new guy is really style of play, the speed of the game. I think they're used to a certain tempo, and they thought they were working hard and fast in high school, and they get here and things are really really fast. Guys are a lot faster than them, so I think they're going to play slow because they're thinking, and we got to get them to the point where they just play. So once we take the thinking out of it, they're going to play a lot faster. How's the depth chart to nickel back behind Rashawn Bell and start to do Wide open. Even his, there, there are no spots right now. Everybody's competing for a job. So it doesn't matter if you've played here three years or three days. Every practice matters. And when we come to practice, the film of this, of this fall camp will determine who's going to walk out with the ones, twos, and threes. And that's going to be very, very fluid all through fall camp. Shaq's obviously an experienced guy from his last couple of schools. Do you, do you see a lot of that, or is he still kind of like a lot of the newcomers just because he's not? He's an older, more mature guy when it comes to fun uh, technique and drills, but he's a young guy in terms of understanding the culture and how we play here. So I think like all newcomers, which I consider him a newcomer in that sense, he is learning how we play. He's learning my coaching style, and he's learning what we're looking for in our players every time we touch the field. So he's in that process as well. He is more mature. He knows how to do some drill work. He knows how to do a couple things, but he's, he's young like the rest of them in that respect.